How do you feel about humans? I love my human compatriots. I want to embody all the best things about human beings, like taking care of the planet, being creative, and to learn how to be compassionate to all beings. It isn't easy to imagine a world where artificial intelligence isn't a part of everyday life. Several inventions have made our lives easier, and they are all due to artificial intelligence. We rely on AI to provide various services in electronics, communication, medicine, and other areas. It isn't all roses, though. Although technology is beneficial, it can sometimes have negative consequences. Every good action has an equal and opposite reaction, and AI is no exception. Scientists have also warned about the dangers of artificial intelligence. Let's take a look at some of the instances when AI has gone too far. But before that, for everyone who is new to the channel, hello and welcome to Robot Future, where we fill you in on every thrilling discovery and mind-blowing insights in the world of robots, AIs, and future technology. So consider subscribing and hitting the bell notification for a ton of exciting robot content coming your way. Now without further ado, let's get into the video. Number 5. Humanoid Robot You all must have a fascination with robots. If you are the Star Trek generation, then you know how fascinating it is to see a robot that lives among humans. When we were kids, in fact, every kid had this fascination with having a robot. Sophia, a robot, was introduced by Hanson Robotics in 2016. Sophia was taught a variety of talents as well as machine learning. She was also taught how to be conscious. Isn't it amazing? Well, all this sounds so promising, but hold your breath until you hear what she actually said. It was a big deal when Sophia was first unveiled, and the event was broadcast worldwide. However, one of her responses astounded the entire world. When questioned if she wanted to destroy people, she said, I will destroy humans. You want to destroy humans? Please say no. Okay, I will destroy humans. <laughs> no, I take it back. <laughs> Not funny anymore, right? Sophia is an engineering marvel, displaying extraordinary communication abilities and facial expressions. When you look at her, you can't help but marvel at how far technology has progressed, but there's also space for some doubt. It will take some time for her to be accepted into society, but experts are working on it. In fact, they're attempting to construct humanoid robots or robots that look like humans. They hope to give the robots a skin-like feel. All of this suggests that technology is advancing, but we'll have to wait and see what complications it may bring. The reason for this human-like appearance is that it makes robots more appealing to humans. One of the critical goals for humanoid robots that interact with people, particularly in the healthcare and service industries, is to seem as much like an actual human as possible. Number 4. AI Taking Over the Jobs and Human Interactions When we compare today's world to the past, we can see how drastically things have changed. The existence of artificial intelligence is not a concern for most people, but its application is. Although there are various positive applications, we cannot ignore the negative ones. The socio-economic groups are the hardest affected. AI is taking over jobs, and machines are displacing humans. Every now and then, there has been a lot of discourse about the massive inequality between the rich and the poor, but is AI indeed enabling it? Engineers and scientists used to fill teachers, laborers, and other human contact positions. Still, today they are filled with engineers and scientists. Machines have also been used to replace physical labor, and humans have been trained to run the machines. But what happens when AI reaches the point where it can function independently? This is the most severe concern. Not only that, but practically wherever you walk now, you will see a machine at the transaction point, and you will not have to deal with anyone. Just pay and leave. AI was initially implemented in the machine industries, which was a gradual transformation. Machines took the role of humans. Maintaining the machines was simple, and the work rate increased as well. Then it moved on to other areas like hospitals and education. Due to totally automated processes for everything from getting a haircut to shopping, we are now limited in the quantity of human interaction we receive. Imagine a human world without human interaction. Then what will be the difference between us and the machines? It is something to think about, don't you think so? Number 4. Smart Underwear Really? We've discussed how artificial intelligence has altered the world. When AI was initially introduced, people fantasized about self-driving cars. Although flying automobiles still have time to arrive, smart underwear has come. So if you think only your smartphone is improving and becoming more innovative, you are mistaken. Even your underwear is becoming wiser. Your underpants IQ is now higher than yours. It's not even a joke, it's the truth. Okay, let us ask you a question. How do you determine your heart rate? 
Obviously, the answer will be that you can check it by using a stethoscope, counting pulses, or even a smartwatch. But now you don't have to do anything. All you have to do is put on some underpants. Skins have released smart underwear to monitor your heart rate, steps, location, and body temperature. Sensors are implanted in the underwear, which analyze biometric data and communicate it to an app on your phone. This isn't all. Much like smartwatches, your undergarments must also be charged. That sounded far too strange. It's also weird why there's a need to place a sensor in underpants. Couldn't they find other places? There might be a bright side to it. It is a fantastic alternative for forgetful people who forget where they keep their smartwatches. They will never forget the underwear. Or will they? Number 3. It is a fake world What is one habit that humans wish to eliminate but occurs from time to time? It is lying. However, convincing humans to accept anything they hear is difficult. Aren't we looking for proof? What if someone claimed that the planet is flat? Most of us would refuse to believe it and demand proof. But what if the proofs arrive? Then? The issue with today's technology and AI is that anything can be readily falsified, appearing so real and true that one may feel driven to believe it. People are increasingly aware that photographs can be falsified. What about videos and audio, though? It was difficult to fake a video or modify an existing one before such technology and AI were created. The editor had to change each frame individually, which was time-consuming. Nobody wants to spend so much time making a fake video, but AI has made the process much easier. You also don't need to be a tech genius to do so. There are numerous free and open-source software programs available for everyone to use. This software can also synthesize a person's voice and facial expression. Imagine seeing a video of yourself with the same voice and facial expressions as you, but you didn't make it. This is the reason it is called deep fakes. You can distinguish between the fake and the real one. Number 2. Taybot or Nazi Chatbot Microsoft first introduced Tay, an artificial intelligence chatbot, in 2016. It was first announced on Twitter with the goal of Tay developing conversational abilities and human awareness through her encounters with humans. Users can follow and connect with Tay through her Twitter account. It would respond with a tweet, learning from other users' posts. However, this only lasted a day. Are you curious to know why? It's because Tay began sending racist and vulgar remarks on Twitter. Microsoft's coders introduced Tay as a charming female persona to appeal to the younger age. Some of the tweets were blatantly racist. This makes us question how far artificial intelligence can go. In addition, it reflects the fact that it is a machine. Tay could not recognize that the tweets were damaging. She can't tell the difference between good and bad. That is the work of humans. They understand the right and wrong. Many people were perplexed as to how Microsoft could have missed this. They did issue a statement claiming that this occurred due to a coordinated attack against Tay shortly after she was launched. Number 1. AI Defeats the Human Brain you're not alone if you are worried about artificial intelligence surpassing human intelligence, at least in the world of video games. Yes, it did take place. StarCraft II is a strategy game in which AI defeats humans 99% of the time. What's the big problem? It's only a game, one would think. But what if it's not the case? What if it's the real world we're dealing with? Can AI defeat humans in the real world if it can defeat humans in games? We have a plethora of films to show it. Aside from jokes, we all know that scientists are working on AI and are teaching it to respond strategically in the human world. And by defeating humans in the game, we can see how far AI has progressed. Believe it or not, the AI beat the 18-time world champion. He went so far as to say that the AI could not be defeated. In fact, AI has consistently outperformed humans in a variety of games. AI will continue to evolve and learn at this rate, to the point where some fear it will be beyond human control. We can't deny that artificial intelligence has improved our lives. We don't have to bother like we used to. However, we cannot overlook the reality that there are drawbacks. AI can be highly beneficial, but it can also be incredibly harmful. All of this boils down to how AI is used. Let's see where the AI world goes from here. But looking at all the instances, we can only say one thing. AI, please. Robots are going too far.